In the age of the iPod, the Xbox and the e-book, you might think there's no longer any place for old-fashioned ink on paper. Not so, says Waterstones buyer Sam Harrison, who shared his top picks with us for festive reading. I thought we'd talk about Russell Brand first, as if I were a betting man, this is probably going to be the biggest book in the market in Christmas week. It's all about his life in the build-up to being famous. So all the awful things he did, all the embarrassing mistakes he made, and his driving ambition to be a celebrity. It's extremely funny, erudite, He's the enfant terrible of modern comedy. This is a fantastic read. It's a parental advisory on that. If you know anything about Russell's life, I wouldn't give it to anyone below the age of 18. The next book I've got for you is A Thousand Splendid Sons by Khaled Husseini. Now, you might remember his first book, The Kite Runner. He's really the darling of reading groups across the land. It's a massive word of mouth success. But the next book I want to talk about is actually my favourite book of the year, and I really hope for anyone out here out there is going to look at this and go out and get it because it's a beautiful book. The Ladybird books which taught us the kings and queens of England, how I learnt my British bird, um, things to make and do on rainy days, it's all in here and the magic of growing up with those books. On the theme of nostalgia, um, one of the dark horses in the bestseller list this year, and if people remember books like Eat, Shoots and Leaves and Shots Miscellany in years gone by, this may well be this book for 2008. I Before E, it's a compendium of all of those forgotten tricks of memory from our school days. 